What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings, TN10, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as a channel. This current ancestor message for the collective ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribe, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate y'all. I do. Any other information about me with the other platforms I am on, please check the description box. All right. I appreciate you. All right. So let's get into it. And see what's up. Let's see. Back to the basics. Okay, so your ancestors could be nudging you to go back to the basics. Trickster is in the reverse. This is giving me an energy where a trickster could have been caught. Yeah, this person was fake. All right, find your voice. Okay, so there could have been a trickster that got caught in your energy. Imagination. Okay, so I'm going to leave that out. Get into nature. All right. Trust. Okay. Great mysteries. So what I'm getting is. For some of you guys. You could have went back to the basics in the situation. And that could have gotten a trickster energy caught up. Okay. So you could have went back to the basics and did something. For some of you guys. You could have went out, out into nature. Or you could have did something that you used to do that you could have stopped doing for a while but when you start doing it again that got a trickster energy caught up in your energy that was trying to like act like that they was real and they weren't okay all right that's what i'm seeing so there is a trickster energy that got caught up they did yeah your hard work is paying off yeah so there is a trickster that got caught up yep they got caught up because for some of you guys you could have released something it's something that you released in your energy or your ancestors are nudging you to release something in your energy you need to go back to the basics so a trickster energy can get caught up okay so if you could have, let's say if you used to do certain things, but you stopped doing them as much, you know, because life got in the way. So this could be like some kind of self-care. This could be meditation. Maybe you don't meditate as much. Maybe you don't take care of yourself like you used to. It's like those kind of things your ancestors want you to get back into. And it's like, as you take care of yourself and do things for yourself, protect your energy, make sure you're doing your cleanses. Okay, and listen, it's catching this person up, this individual that was trying to act like they was authentic and shit. All right, don't let pride get in the way. So don't let pride get in the way of your success. A fiery climax approaches. It's time to release negativity. Your guardian angel is here with you. You are not alone. Be devoted and committed bottom of the deck your commitment is being tested so your commitment is being tested at this time your guardian angel is with you to try to help you let go of negativity okay something to do to leo aries scorpio capricorn okay so what's this negativity that the collective needs to release what is this negativity that the collective needs to release Sun card. What's this negativity? All right, five of cups. So for some of you guys, you need to release like negativity when it comes to letting people go that show you who they are. For some of you guys, there could be people that's very close to you 
that's really showing you who they are. But it's like really hard for you to let go of these people or something like that. Okay. Even though like I'm hearing there is some kind of enlightenment that could have happened. But this is with the five of cups is giving me like somebody still holding on. Okay. So what I'm seeing here, there may be some kind of tower that occur. That's for your good. All right. Your ancestors want you to know they love you before this tower happened okay but this is a tower that's needed in order for you to let go of this negativity that's in your energy okay it's 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 needed okay because somebody feel like that they got a strong hold on you like they can or something this is somebody that feel like they got control over you but this person you need to let them go though yeah, because your journey is separate from theirs, okay? You got to separate. What you should be doing is separate. And you have to do things a certain way, devoted and committed, okay? There are certain things that you have to do because your path is different, okay? So it's like you got to release this individual, okay? Yep. So I'm doing a Scorpio. Strong Scorpio, uh, strong Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces energy. And then you got Aries, strong Leo, okay? Yeah. So your commitment is being tested to see if you really gonna let this go. But for a lot of you guys, there is a tower coming that's gonna make you separate. <laughs> that's what I'm hearing. But, I mean... Every tower is not bad, but it's always for your good, though. Yeah, karmic trench. Okay, this could be some kind of karmic energy that could be trying to hold on to you. That's why you got to release this person. You got to release this person. Okay? Because this person is a tricky energy anyway. They're not real. This person is like a false person in your energy that you need to be letting go. They're not being authentic. Okay? But you're going to be shown, though. It's going to be a tower moment that's going to show you, though. Yeah. Reflection. Yep. Something to do with 19. Could be significant. Wishes fulfilled. Yep. But it's like your ancestors want you to know that your wishes will be fulfilled. But you got to let go of this person, though. This, this particular individual. Yeah, the willow. And we have commitment. And we have balance. Yeah, I'm hearing like you have to make commitment for the commitment that's more balanced. Whether this is a friendship or a relationship. <clears throat> okay? So there is something that's coming through. It's going to shock you. It may even like, you know, ruffle your uh, emotions a little bit. But this is something that's meant to happen to break this karmic, you know, this karmic tie with this person. Okay? For some of you guys, this is even giving me an energy of you committing to the wrong motherfucker or motherfuckers. Okay? So your ancestors are like, okay, now, nah, we've given you time to let this go. You keep, you know, kind of like, eh, so we about to bring this tower in. Because they already have given you the sun, which is the enlightenment, okay? So it's like, okay, so we gave you the sun. We gave you the enlightenment. Now we about to get you with the tower. So that way, when we get you with the tower, you will know. You ain't going to go back after this time. You know what I mean? So it's one of them kind of energies. But you will heal. Things will be balanced out. You will have your wish fulfillment. But this is needed in order for you to go to the next level on your journey. Okay? Like they say, everybody can't go with you. Everybody can't go. Even the people that are dear to your heart. Okay? Yeah. Your perception. Okay? Some things is about to change in your energy. Yeah. Appearance. Yup. Current energy. Nope. Observation. Yep. 
Your past on loved ones want you to take a closer look at something. Yep, take a closer look. Messenger. What else? Things and service. Okay, so for some of you guys, this is this could be a person that you could be helping. You could have assisted. But your ancestors are about to bring in like a wise spirit or something like that. Your ancestors are reminding you. Yeah, look at that. Ancestry at the back. Your ancestors are reminding you that you already know what's up. Stop questioning yourself. You already know what's up in this energy. So act like you know. That's what I'm hearing. Act like you know. All right. Mm -hmm. current energy mm -mm. good gentleman sirene we have marriage mountain man Boop. Okay. Okay. So for some of you guys, whoever this person is, if this is a relationship, this person love giving to other people. They love giving to other people. Okay. In a situation, but this person can't seem to let you go. Okay. If this is a relationship. This person is like, they love fucking around with other people, but they can't let you go or even want to let you go. And that's, I feel like that that's, that's building a mountain in between y'all. Because this person is like, they doing too much, is what I'm hearing. They doing too much. Okay? But this is giving me an energy where it's like your commitment is going to be being tested with this person, though. Like, something big is about to happen if this is a relationship. Yeah, this is going to be something here. <laughs> this is going to be something. This could be like... Two people of different race together. Okay. This is something. Alright. So what popped out was Raven. Confidence. You are encouraged to disconnect from the physical or materialistic plan. And move to the spiritual realm. You have a deep spiritual connection which you mustn't ignore. You are on the brink of transformation and your divine purpose may be revealing itself okay adventure you need to live up to your fullest potential explore new directions and take risk in order to grow as it as an individual change may be uncomfortable what did i say that tower that's coming in you know it may be a little uncomfortable i said that your ancestors they love you before this tower hit they love you but you know sometimes change may be uncomfortable but it's necessary Okay, so like I said, there is a change coming in. All right, that's like the vibe I was feeling with this. Okay, but it's necessary. So I'm hearing trust the process. Okay, this is not to put fear in anybody either. Because regardless of the fact, you're going to have a wish fulfillment come out of it. Okay, so you're going to be good, you know, when it all boils down. Okay, so you gonna be good when it all boils down, y'all. But this is a tower that's gonna be something shocking. Someone could love Jordans. Do rag, somebody could wear a lot. Something to do with 47, 74, January 4th, January 7th, April 4th, April 7th, April 1st, April 17th, April 14th. July 7th, July 4th, July 1st. Okay. So, trickster energy has been caught. Or they about to be. You're not going to look at this person the same no more. Once this person get caught up, you're not going to look at them the same. 
You're not going to look at them the same. Multiple ear piercings. Yep. Current energy. Current energy. Somebody could have a tongue piercing. We have dresses. An incubus. 50s. We have the letter K. High class. Left arm tattoos. No beard. Dark liquor. Short hair waves. For some of you guys, that uh, incubus energy, it don't have to be a mate. It could be a homeboy. It could be a brother. It could be an uncle. Okay? It don't always have to be like a mate. Okay? Printed tops. We have Ford. Janitor or housekeeper. We have Q. Something to do with Aquarius or two. Face tattoos. Somebody could smoke cigars, miscarriage. We have K, E. We have I. Something to do with a Leo, or somebody could be a life path number eight. Thirties. Assistant. Sunglasses. We have P. Somebody could love like making pies. Okay, somebody love baking. Big chest, F, SUV, we have hair wraps, okay, something with Keisha, I heard Keisha, okay, I heard Frederick, something to do with 28 or 82, All right. Something with Kiara. I heard Kiara. I heard flamboyant. Something with flamboyant. I heard. Okay. Okay. Uh, what's what's that skin? Uh, it starts with the V. I'm picturing someone that has that skin. It starts with the V. Is it verter? But y'all know what I'm talking about. It starts with a V. Okay. I'm seeing somebody can have skin like that. Okay. It's V I L I, something like that. Okay. What else, spirit? Something with Kiki. Somebody's name could be Kiki. Okay. That's crazy. So your commitment is being tested, y'all, at this time. So we gonna see what, what happens on what you do. Like I say, you know, your ancestors and your guides or whoever, you always get tested, okay? You always get tested to see where you at, okay? If you really are at a point where you can elevate to the next level or are you at a point where you can re really receive this uh manifestation you know you get tested all right you get tested so this is something here this is what somebody could be going through or about to go through okay I heard Felicia. I heard Fontaine. Fontaine. All right. I heard Sangria. I heard Samantha. Okay. Something with Ikea. Someone could love them some damn Ikea, okay? <laughs> Somebody love them some Ikea.
All right, let's see what else. Life path number two and life path number eight. I'm hearing life path number four or two, okay? All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. I really hope that these messages helped you guys of some shape or form. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. I heard Renee as well. I heard Renee and I heard Renisha. Renisha. I heard Ray or Raymond as well. All right, you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.